birthday, Joyce. Before I go on my speech, can I just point out how beautiful you look tonight? But you always look beautiful, so what's the difference? Um, anyways, for those of you who don't know, I'm Joyce's second cousin, but you're like a sister I never had. I know I can go to you for anything and everything, and whenever we sleep over, we pull all-nighters, and then we regret it in the morning. We can never shut up when we're together, but like, even though we don't hang out all the time, I know that our bond is stronger than that. You're like one of the brightest people I know, and you'll go so far in life. You can conquer anything you want if you set your mind to it. I love you so much, and happy birthday. Love you. Jamie Pangilina. because we went by the same name, Jamie. By the way, sorry for making you switch. Um, you were a familiar face in everything that I did, from basketball and tennis to English classes and art classes. Thank you for being such an inspiration for positivity and perseverance. Continue to grow and be happy throughout your life. I wish you the best in the coming years. I love you and happy birthday. Jade Willis. <laughs> Joyce, for the time I've known you, we've made incredible memories together and you've become like a little sister to me. You are such a caring person and you always see the good in others no matter what. You're beautiful inside and out with an amazing personality. You have the biggest heart for anyone and everyone and your kindness never runs out. <laughs> never change your amazing ways. You're smart, loyal, and passionate. I'm so proud of you and I know you'll go far in life. I wish you all the success and happiness life takes you. I can't wait to see you grow as a stunning young woman. Happy birthday and I love you. Kira Marshall. Sienna Burdan. You definitely, 
uh, a friend that's always looking out for like my best interests, and he'll always tell tell something to me straight, even if it's not what I want to hear. And um, I know you, you're just the type of person that you'll never turn your back on somebody, and um, you're just the type of person that you I never have to question your loyalty. Um, I just <laughs> I'm glad that you've become one of my really good friends. And I know this friendship will last a lifetime. You could do anything the world throws at you because you're smart, beautiful, and the, have the determination to do anything. Before I end, I just want to share a verse with you to carry on as you go through college and as you go through life. And um, as is Exodus um, chapter 14, verse 14, the Lord Himself will fight for you to stay calm. And I feel like you just need a reminder anytime anything's going bad, just always remember. And I love you. <laughs> and happy to <laughs> Chelsea Pereira. from a hug 
a hand to hold when you're not feeling good, help with an Instagram caption, advice, or anything in between. I truly miss seeing you every day, my Joycey, and I can't wait to see you every day at school again. Thank you for being one of the sisters I never had, and I hope and pray that I've been able to make any impact on your life that you've made on mine. I love you so much. Happy birthday. Stephanie Lynn. because I swear it's routinely now, whatever you walk in. <laughs> Anyways, although you're sometimes a pain in the booty, you're such a down, honest, beautiful, funny, sometimes, and an amazing individual. You're not just my sweet mate, but someone I can now call one of my best friends. You're so determined and strong, and I know that you have such a bright big future ahead of you. Remember that wherever life takes you, don't stop being you, and never lose that shine that rubs off on people, because you're definitely one of the people in this world that makes it better. You've come to me for so many things, whether it's advice. Oh, my phone just locked again. I'm sorry. Okay, okay. You've come to me for so many things, whether it's advice, problems, you trying to beat Loretto in freshman class senator, or just to be mean to each other. And I'm honored to have grown such a close relationship with you, to have you trust me like that and vice versa. Know that whatever happens, I'm always here for you and someone you can confide in. I love you, Joyce, and thank you for coming into my life. Happy 18, down me, me, me. Up next, we have Lauren Briones. Jamie, I've known you for so long, um, 14 years, 
we have too many memories, but um, I'd like to keep them between us because you're very special to me. And um, <clears throat> but I will share a funny story. Uh, I don't think you remember, but um, I knew we'd be really close because it was in kindergarten, and um, I was really frustrated because I needed to use the bathroom, but the button on the pants, you know, like the pants, they would. <laughs> There was like a secret room oh. inside, <laughs> and I couldn't, yeah, but you helped me, and no, <laughs> no one left it. Um, and I knew we'd be best friends, and, um, <laughs> but I didn't know that 14 years later, you would still be there for me through thick and thin. <clears throat> um, thank you for ugly laughing with me, for crying with me for hours. Um, <clears throat> Um, I swear people tell us we're alike all the time because we have our slow moments, you know what I mean? <laughs> um, but thank you for everything. This life would not be the same without you. You have an amazing soul, you're selfless, your faith in God, um, and your motivation is an inspiration to me. I don't, know how, I don't know many people like you who have such a beautiful heart and it shows on the outside. Um, <clears throat> I love you so much, sis. You're not just a friend or a sister to me, and you know that you can come to me whenever. We are so far, but we're hours apart. We're four hours apart, but... God, I made it. I made it. And I feel you from far away. I do. Okay, I'm gonna stop. I love you so much. Happy birthday. Up next, we have Joanne Bamba. throughout all of high school were next to each other and we even parked our cars next to each other for senior year. Now you're my roommate and we're basically together 24-7. We just can't get away from each other. We have big history together and all I can say is Eric Sinron. Just kidding. Thank you for being so funny, so kind, loving, and for letting me and Crystal use your nightlight every night. Honestly, I love how we can joke around, but yet have serious conversations about anything. I know I can count on you. Happy belated birthday, Joyce. Crystal Cortez. Next 
Joyce, you are truly one of a kind, as most of us know. You spread warmth and positivity that anyone can feel by just standing next to you. To quote something my brother once told me, Joyce is an angel that God placed on earth. She's so selfless and would stop to help anyone in need. Hearing that from him truly meant something, because he wouldn't just say that about anyone. After getting to know you, I've seen the way God works through you. I've seen the way you care for others, my family included. You have such a special place in my heart for loving my family the way that you do. You're so giving, and you make sure everyone is happy before you even think of yourself. It's a wonder someone so small has a heart so big. I've seen how your confidence has flourished, and you've grown into such a strong woman, one that you should be proud of. You are absolutely radiant, and you should never settle for anything less than what makes you happy, because you deserve the world. I hope I get to continue watching you grow from the amazing young woman you already are into the one you're destined to become. Joyce, you shine brighter than any star in the sky just by smiling, and I hope and pray you never let anyone dim your light. There are not many people in this world who have such a caring heart for the way that you do. You've become like a sister to me, and I'll always be for you in any time of uncertainty. Happy birthday, Joyce. I hope you wake up and feel celebrated every day. Now up is Carol Dominguez. My dearest Joyce, happy Cotty Day B. You look so beautiful. I'm going to start from the very beginning, probably like around fourth grade. The thing I remember the most is when you slept over at my house and you talked about what elementary girls talk about, boys, but of course other things. I think the funniest thing that we've ever done was giving to see a bath and your dad took the ugliest photos of us. And another thing that I remember is when I taught you how to dance. Yeah. And you know you did pretty good. Just kidding, you did great. Um, one thing that I can't believe is that you still remember our hip hop performance performance from fifth grade. Like really, Joyce remembers every dance that she's ever done. You are one of the craziest, but actually the craziest, weird, loving, genuine, and kind-hearted girls that I know. But one thing that I love most about you is that you remind me that I'm never alone, and I'm always loved. Like every phone call we have, you always say I love you at the end, giving me the best hugs comforting me when I have my low moments, especially the stressful times in college. You've been there for me during the joys of my life, especially in my lowest of lows. When I have my low moments, you always ask me if I want to go get Rubio's, eat hot Cheetos and ice cream. You are really my best friend, but mostly a sister that I never had. I just always remember our phone calls when you used to tell me how happy you are. And I just burst into tears because you're so deserving of all the love and happiness in the world. Just know that I promise I'll always be there for you every step of the way. Joyce, you've been by my side for 14 years and I couldn't be more thankful to have a person like you in my life. I love you so much and I can't wait to tell our kids our our adventures of our crazy life. I love you. Kayla Panikbatan.
Last but not least, Alexa David. Please stand up. 
And now go around, make a wish, and blow out all your candles. <laughs> Happy birthday! 